Hey everyone, what's going on? It's Greg with another all-in-one RC unboxing. I am super excited today because I have another package arrived from Banggood USA. Uh, Banggood or Banggood USA, if you've not known or ordered from them, they have a distribution warehouse center similar to Amazon. They are set up across the country uh, in the United States and across the globe. They are a pretty good service. You can get a lot of different uh, Chinese products from them and I've been ordering a lot of RC from them. Uh, as you know, I'm trying to order specifically ready to run or ready to fly or all in one RCs. Everything that comes that you need in the box to set yourself up and going. I am super excited to unbox another product that uh, is from URUAV. I believe that's how you say that. Not quite sure. It might be URUAVF. Uh, it is a 130 second scale micro RC car, as you see. Mini high speed RC car. It also says on the box Extreme Work RC. So I'm not really sure what the actual brand name is, but there's a lot on there. It currently retails on Banggood USA at $16.99. I believe I paid $17 with shipping. I'm super excited about this because I got a car. Uh, I will show you in comparison in just a minute. I got a car at the same product uh, size, same product brand. Um, this is supposed to be the truck, and I previously got the sticker in the way, but a buggy. Uh, very excited because I hope it performs. It's pro fully proportional throttle, but not fully proportional steering. I'm just trying to look and see uh, if the price has changed on this. No, it's currently still showing at $16.99, so I paid just over $17 bucks with shipping, um, and I ordered this on August 6th. It is now August 18th, so that's pretty good. That was 12 days just to get here. Um, and it also came in a package with two other things, so I'm pretty excited. So anyway, here's the unboxing of the truck. Again, the URUAVF 132nd Mini High Speed RC Car. It says age is 8 plus. Um, on the bottom, it will say a bunch of warning labels and all kinds of languages. Uh, it also says 9115M, which is the model number. Uh, which was also the same model number of the truck. Uh, I'm sorry, as the buggy. The buggy is the 9115, and the truck is the 9115M. And so it says it goes 25 kilometers per hour. I'm not sure about that. It's probably pretty close. The, I'm pretty excited, as I said, because the car buggy does go incredibly fast and it handles well. Again, it's not proportional. Um, steering but it's proportional throttle and it's got a high and low rate and it only takes two double A's in the transmitter so uh, it charges incredibly fast it's less than a half an hour probably 28 27 minutes something like that and the runtime if you really mess around with the throttle um, you know if you really just keep it low goose it uh, and don't use it a lot you can get probably half an hour 40 minutes probably half an hour runtime on this um, you know, but if you go fast and full throttle in the second rate of this whole time, um, it's probably going to, I don't know, run down in about 15 minutes. So I'm super excited. I've been using it on my kitchen floor and downstairs in a big rug area, which is a high traffic rug. All right. So as you can see, it comes with the transmitter, comes with a charge cable, the manual, and the truck is in the packaging. I'm super excited because it looks just as good as the buggy. Uh, the transmitter looks exactly the same. It is, it says Extreme Work RC on the trigger, and you can see the throttle is fully proportional, not clicker springs. Uh, the steering is clicking. Um, you know, it's it's not proportional. But what I found is if you click right and then hold, or click left and then hold, then you can easily keep the car going in that direction. So, and if you slow down the throttle, you can kind of turn corners. If you put it on high rate, the car is almost not uncontrollable, but it wants to fly. It almost lifts up. It can donut. Um, it, it's a lot of different. The, these cars are really crazy. For under $20, it's really enjoyable. Here is your charger. It's a USB. There's a red light that turns on when it charges. Uh, it goes out when it charges, turns back on when it's fully charged. Um, you can see it's a tiny little, I believe it's 3.7 volt battery that's built into the car or the truck. A 3.790 milliamp lithium ion battery. It says it's a 60 meter remote distance, a 30 minute charge time, 11 minute playing time. Um, again, it's the same exact manual that came with the last one, so I'm just going to open the truck and show you everyone that. 
Uh, and then I'm excited because I'm going to put this thing on the charger and batteries in the remote and then I'll do a review of it driving around. Hopefully everything will be just as great as the other one. Uh, it's wedged in there a little bit better than the buggy was, so give me one. There we go. Uh, so there it is. Check it out. It's super small. This is my cell phone in comparison. I don't know if you can see. That's the best way to do that. It's smaller than my cell phone, which I believe is six inches long. Uh, so again, there it is in the palm of my hand. This thing is super small, but it looks incredible. It looks just like a full-scale monster truck. Um, it says Cracker on the side, and it's got the biohazard symbol on the top. Uh, decals on the back, green. It also says down the side, Born to Race. On the back, there's just tail lights. It's a pulley. It's a plastic body. The tires are awesome. They're actually rubber, which is great. The tires on the buggy are not. So I could actually probably take this outside, which is exciting. Um, the buggy tires are foam, and I haven't taken it outside, and I probably don't plan to. On the bottom, you got your charge port and an on-off switch. Again, the car charges in about 25 to 27 minutes and runs for a good half hour, depending on how much you use the throttle. Um, it does have two pins on the back, which I believe you can take off and look at the body, but I'm not going to do I'm sorry, there's a pin on the front as well, so three pins total to take the body off if you wanted to change it. I haven't looked online. Maybe they have some swappable stuff, but all in all, it looks really cool. Um, again, it's super, super small, but super fast if it's anything in comparison to the buggy, which I think it will be. I'm pretty excited to take this uh charge it up and get it going and get it outside and I'll have another review. So again, the URUAVF on Banggood USA or Banggood comes in at less than 20 bucks with shipping. All I need is two AA's and a half hour to charge it and I guarantee you'll have a lot of fun. Enjoy.